This video will focus on describing, calculating, and interpreting the following six key profitability ratios. Gross profit. Operating profit. Net profit. Sales to total assets. Return on assets. And return on equity. Let's start our review of profitability ratios with the gross profit ratio, which is simply the percentage of sales revenue left after cost of goods sold, and we calculate the ratio by dividing gross profit into net sales. Big Dog's gross profit ratio for 2024 was 21.88%, calculated as $700,000 in gross profit divided by $3,200,000 in net sales. We can also interpret this to mean that for every $1 in net sales, Big Dog generates a gross profit of $0.21.88 cents to cover remaining expenses. For 2023 and 2022, the gross profit ratios were 23.21% and 23.08%, respectively. This ratio has not changed significantly over the three years, but a small decline as a percentage can affect net income, because gross profit is a large component of the income statement. The next profitability ratio is the operating profit ratio, which is simply the percentage of sales revenue left after cost of goods sold and operating expenses. We calculate it by taking the income from operations and divide by net sales. Big Dog's operating profit ratio for 2024 is 9.938% calculated as $300,000 in income from operations divided by $3,200,000 in net sales. We can interpret this to mean that for every $1 in net sales, the company generates 9.38 cents in operating profit. The 2023 and 2022 ratios are 9.79% and 8.72% calculated in the same way. We can conclude from the ratios that, despite both increasing sales and income from operations, the operating profit ratios are relatively flat. We can also see that sales is not keeping pace with increases in cost of goods sold and operating expenses, resulting in a significant deceleration of increases from 34% to 9%. Another profitability ratio is the net profit ratio, also commonly referred to as the profit margin ratio, and is calculated simply as net income divided by net sales. Big Dog's net profit ratio for 2024 is 3.63% calculated as $116,000 in net income divided by $3,200,000 in net sales. This means that for every dollar in net sales, the company earns a bottom-line profit of 3.63 cents. The ratios for 2023 and 2022 are 4.18% and 4.79%, respectively, calculated the same way. From this, we can conclude that net income is relatively flat over the three years due to increasing interest expenses from increasing liabilities. The next profitability ratio is the sales-to-total asset ratio, which measures sales earned relative to assets invested and calculated as net sales divided by average total assets, where the average total assets is calculated as the sum of the assets at the beginning of the year and the end of the year divided by two. For Big Dog, the 2024 ratio is 1.3919 to 1, or 139.19% calculated as $3,200,000 in net sales divided by average total assets of $2,299,000. The average total assets is calculated as the beginning of year, or end of the previous year total assets of $2,112,000 plus ending total assets of $2,486,000 divided by 2. This can be interpreted to mean that for every $1 invested in assets, the company generates $1.39 in net sales. The 2023 ratio is 1.5869 to 1, or 158.69%. From the data we can see that both sales and average total assets have increased, but sales has weakened relative to the amount of assets invested each year. Assets are not producing revenue as effectively as in the past, so further investigation is required. In addition, industry averages for comparative data would be useful. The fifth profitability ratio is return on assets, commonly known as ROA which measures the efficiency of assets used to produce income from operations and is calculated as the income from operations divided by average total assets. For 2024, Big Dog's return on assets was 0.1305 to 1, or 13.05%, 
calculated as $300,000 in operating income divided by $2,299,000 in average total assets. This means that for every $1 invested in assets, Big Dog is able to generate 13.05 cents in operating income. For 2023, the ROA was 15.53%. Both income from operations and average total assets have increased, but income from operations has weakened relative to the amount of assets invested each year. From this, we can observe that assets are not being used as efficiently as in the past, so further investigation is required. In addition, more information about the company's plans and projections would be useful. The last profitability ratio is return on equity, commonly known as ROE, which measures the return to shareholders in the form of net income earned for the owners and is calculated simply as net income divided by average equity and where average equity is calculated as the beginning of year equity plus end of year equity divided by 2. For 2024, Big Dog's ROE was 0.0956 to 1, or 9.56%, calculated as $116,000 in net income divided by average equity of $1,213,000. The average equity is calculated as the beginning of year equity balance of $1,195,000 plus the end of year balance of $1,231,000 divided by 2. We can interpret this to mean that for every $1 in owner equity, the company generates 9.56 cents in net income. For 2023, the ROE was 10.43% calculated the same way. From this, we can observe that net income has weakened relative to the amount of equity invested by shareholders over the two-year period. Industry averages would be useful. For example, if the industry average was 5%, then the company's ratios would be considered to be favorable or a positive indicator.